Hello friends, my name is Alan Lee MJ. In this tutorial, I am going to create um, how uh, I am going to create a style that can be used in a smartphone. So I just already created a smartphone here. Um, in the main window, um, I just created a text. Inside this text, okay. Here I already applied a particular style over here. Uh, we can check how to create the style and to apply to this particular text. For that, we have to go to the transaction smartphones. Sorry, slash o. Here we can see uh, there are three options, forms, styles and text modules. We are going to create a style for the smartphone. So we can give a meaningful name for uh, the style that I am going to create. Is that style underscore smartphone free and click on create. See. In the left side of the screen, we can see there are three options, header data, paragraph format and the character format. The header data actually uh, specifies the details of the style, the basic details of the style that we are going to create. Uh, here are the details that we are given, uh, basic details we are going to give for this particular style. Here uh, the standard paragraph actually means the default paragraph that would be applied when we are using this style uh, in a smartphone. So now it is empty. Uh, for this, uh, for filling this this option, we have to first create a paragraph format. For that, we are double clicking on the paragraph format and click on create. We can give a meaningful name here. This must be a two two character length. I'm giving it as P1 and press on checking. So. I, I just created a paragraph P1. We have to give a meaningful description for this paragraph. Paragraph paragraph one. Here are the basic details that we want to give for creating this particular paragraph format P1. See uh, here the alignment, left alignment, left margin. I'm giving it as two point, and the right margin also I'm giving it as two point. And pressing enter in the font tab we can give the details of the font normally we are uh, using courier font so we can give another uh, we can give the courier and we can specify the size for that particular paragraph format here i am giving it as 15 we can also specify the font style, whether it would be um, bold, bold italic or, or italic. And uh, we can also uh, check on this underlined option or color option. Here I am not giving anything. The next thing I want to do is to create a character format. For that double click on the character format and just, on, just press on create. We have to give a name for the character. I am giving it as C1. Press check. Here also we want to give a meaningful name for the character format and give it, in, give, give it as character. I'm giving it as character format 1. In the font tab, we want to specify which uh, the character format belongs to which font family. I'm giving here a task courier. I'm also specifying the font size as 20 and uh, I'm giving it as italic um, and also we can specify a color here for this particular for, uh, character format I'm creating press on this I'm giving a green color for this particular character format we now just created uh, a paragraph format and a character format of the style and we're going to save I'm saving it as a local object
I'm going to check it. It's showing an error. It's showing that you want to fill the standard paragraph. See in the header data, as I specified earlier, you want to specify the standard paragraph here. See the paragraph format I just created P1 is available here. You want to specify this and you want to check it again. Yes. And click on activate. Now we just created a style called the is style underscore sf3 let's copy it want to go to the smartphone we just created click on the double click on the style see we, we are going to apply the style just created to this particular text for that go to the output option here we want to give the style which is created and giving it as is it style underscore sf underscore 3 and pressing enter I'm coming back to the general attributes time see we just created a style and uh, the paragraph one and the character format one is already there because we, we, we have already given uh, the style we just created in the output option just uh, I think uh, I hope you all showed how we can create a style and can be successfully applied to a particular smartphone thank you very much